Alright guys, in this video, I'm just going to go through the settings. I'm not really going to explain. Well, actually, I'm going to explain why I'm going. First, you just click edit. This is the lowest and the best settings for lowest input delay for Fortnite, specifically. I'm not capping. This is, you guys see me play the game. Literally, will look like your macro, and there's no macros in this stuff. No macros, nothing. No macros, nothing. As you guys see, no, no macros. But these are the best settings uh, for DS4. If you guys want to make videos on other softwares, like uh, if you don't know already, Time Res. Uh, if you don't know already, a lot of people use Anti Micro. Anti Micro also lowers your uh, input delay. It's not a macro. It's just fucking lowers your input delay that's all it does bro but it's micro a lot of people get confused with macro make sure you guys have this on 360 make sure you guys have this on 1ms I'm just speed running this because I like to keep my videos quick and simple and explain it have this on 360 make sure you copy all of this unassigned all of these this is for a PlayStation 4 controller but you can do this for all controllers all controllers I play on original PlayStation 4 controller I know a lot of you guys will too but even the PS5 controller works in here now they updated it if you guys want need to look at how to install DS4, like up a video, come back to this video. No video on YouTube explains the best settings for Fortnite specifically. Make sure you guys pause it. I'm going to go through it one more time. Pause it where you got to pause it and copy all these settings. Trust me, bro. And that's pretty much it. Make sure you guys copy all of that. I play Bluetooth. That's why you see this right here. But if you play a wired, that's a lot more input delay. I suggest switching to Bluetooth. If you don't have Bluetooth, get what I got off of Amazon. It's a... Bluetooth chip, literally seven dollars. I connect to my PC and then I play Bluetooth forever, and I keep my wire connected to my wall, so it's infinitely charged. And I, and wired is just hella delay if you don't know already. I got you. I guess I'm gonna make a bunch of video on this if this video does well. And that's pretty much it. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. And uh, if you are tra having trouble with your Elton R2, be sure to move this up and this up right here. The max output right here as you guys see and your sensitivity move these up if it's your L2 go in this section if you're R2 go in this section and that's pretty much it you shouldn't have problems with anything else if you have problems just ask me in the comment section and that's pretty much the end of the video quick and simple hope you guys enjoyed the video be sure to like subscribe all that and let me know what videos y'all want next like Tamarez, DS4 Windows uh, Anti-Micro let me know and peace out